Hello, this time I will produce a special project video. You have seen many DOE declassified nuclear test videos. Some of the videos have obvious signs of being edited. Today we will reveal the secrets. What is the content of these videos before they were edited? Among the series of nuclear weapons films declassified by DOE in 1997, there was one title of film Operation Plumbob, Military Effects Studies. We found the unedited color version and found some pre-edited footage, but unfortunately the color version has no audio track. There are several signs of editing in this film. After playing this video for about 5 minutes, the scene is cut after when a person a walks up a hill and then downhill. Than you can see that this, this clip has a very obvious sign of being of edited. Studies laid out and arranged around Priscilla zero point. Indicating these curved surface structures to be an efficient type for use in the high overpressure regions at least up to 70 PSI. When the person in the video is walking downhill, there is a very obvious edited scene. What kind of scene is there in the edited place? Now we will reveal it to you. The original picture looked like this. It was a picture of detonating an atomic bomb at Operation Plumbob, Priscilla. What you're watching now is the unedited color version but it doesn't have a soundtrack. One footage was quite shocking. It was the first time I saw this footage. It was a group of soldiers conducting military operations. The footage looked very close to the ground zero. This is a very interesting footage. A large number of people are planning for atomic bomb operations. A lot of dust is flying around the test site. This shot may look like morning fog, and footage show a huge mushroom cloud in the background, and cameraman couldn't take a picture of the complete mushroom cloud. You can see what it looked like before it was edited. After this screen, it started to match the DOE version. Indicating these curved surface structures to be an efficient type for use in the high overpressure regions at least up to 70 PSI. The three responding domes of six inch thick concrete suffered more damage than expected. The one at 88 PSI was practically a total loss, while the dome at 42 PSI had its windward side caved in. There was no in addition, there is another part of this film that has been edited. I will make another episode to introduce it when I have time. This film was not easy to make, and we need your support. It took me three hours to edit and introduce this video. I hope you will continue to support me. Thank you for watching.